okay? Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Smell. And can you help me put those together? Can you put those together for me? These are the only ones they have left. I'm making a paper chain. Hi, I'm Jerry Zahorczak, the Secretary of Education for the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. In Pennsylvania, we have the goal that we want to know every child by name. We want to make sure our children are proficient in all content areas at grade level. And we want to do that without exception. No exception for background, condition, or circumstance. All means all. Every child, every child by name. SAS. SAS is the architecture, the blueprint, for a vision that we have in Pennsylvania. Standard line systems linked to produce a roadmap for all of us to follow. Standards, curriculum, instruction, assessment, interventions, materials, resources, SAS. Hi, I'm Mike Walsh, a Deputy Secretary for Administration at the Department of Education. We work every day to make sure PD employees have the tools and resources they need to implement SAS. The Center for Data Quality and Information Technology provides support for the portal to be available 24 hours a day for teachers, students, and parents. In the Bureau of Human Resources, we are committed to ensure all of the employees in the Department of Education understand the standard aligned systems. At the Bureau of Management Services, we're also committed to student achievement in terms of delivering the mail, making sure the phones work, doing procurement and purchasing. At the Bureau of Budget and Fiscal Management, our goal is to identify targets to maximize resources for the students and education programs in Pennsylvania. In the Bureau of Community and Student Services, we know that this is the best opportunity for our children in Pennsylvania to succeed. We look to the important supports such as our school nurses, our school guidance counselors, social workers. How do they make a difference in ensuring that students have a safe and healthy learning environment? Hi, I'm Harriet Victor. I'm Deputy Secretary for the Office of Child Development and Early Learning. We have the privilege of overseeing all of the Commonwealth's early learning programs. These are fundamentally one system one philosophy of how we do well for our children and one system of support, interventions, and aids to really make sure that teachers have what they need to do a great job for kids. SAS is about working together, working together to meet the needs of all children. In the Bureau of Special Education, we know that working in isolation, segregation, or silos doesn't work. Now we've created a foundation where all means all, knowing that all students can achieve. Bureau of Teaching and Learning is the, the subgroup within the agency that's primarily responsible for the implementation of, of SAS. Years ago when you created, and I've been around years, uh, a curriculum, it usually ended up in a loose leaf book and then it was put on a shelf someplace and frankly gathered dust. What we are doing is making that curriculum alive, changing as it should change and, and contemporary as it should be. I'm Diane Castellano, the Deputy Secretary for Elementary and Secondary Education. The Voluntary Model Curriculum will help teachers pick the best lesson plans that are tailored to their students' interests, competencies, and prior skill levels. It's voluntary, it's best practice. The Bureau of Assessment and Accountability is the bureau that's responsible for the state assessment. Obviously, we believe that assessment is very important because without assessment, we have no way of determining where a student is. It gives teachers the, the information that they need in order to make data-driven decisions. With the Bureau of Career and Technical Education, we are doing a number of things that are related to the standards-aligned system. We have the statewide technical standards that we've aligned with the statewide academic standards. We are very much supporters of SAS and the Bureau of School Leadership and Teacher Quality. Much of what we do centers around teacher certifications, and we're very excited about the fact that teachers who are now going to graduate from teacher preparation institutions really much better know what they have to do from day one when they walk into the classroom. We in the Office of Post-Secondary or Higher Education are committed to SAS and, and the goals of increasing college access for all students. By fully applying SAS in our K-12 schools, we should see more students go on to post-secondary education and, and surely we'll see more students that are prepared for post-secondary work. Standard life system. In Pennsylvania, we're doing one thing. We're building the standard line system. I love school. We think SAS provides a great framework for teachers and administrators in Pennsylvania to maximize student achievement. Kindergarten rocks. The best mentors for teachers are other teachers. 
the online standards aligned community will permit that to happen. Teaching matters. I'm excited about SAS because it's one way of wrapping up all the tenants that we know make it possible for teachers and administrators to do well by our kids. I love school every time my name. We're proud to be in a commonwealth that is leading in that way and now joining a nation that is turning towards that kind of leadership to join the rest of the world to produce really productive students. I love kindergarten. Every child of my name. SAS! So now you see how our offices and our deputies and their work is linked to the Standard Aligned Systems Movement here in Pennsylvania. I really appreciate your taking the time to understand this. Thanks for watching.